Hey everybody, just uh, another update for you guys, uh, one day before we leave for the USA. Yeah. We're basically just spending the day getting all our paperwork in order, make sure we packed everything. Um, yeah, everything to do with visas and, and money and travel insurance, blah, blah, blah. We're doing all that today. Uh, Bald is traveling to Auckland today as well. He will be staying at uh, Zirkles the night <clears throat> um, before their flight tomorrow afternoon. They're also doing something for on TV tomorrow morning in New Zealand. I think you might find out more about that later. Um, yeah, and I've also got Colt flying from Adelaide to my place tonight as well, and we're going to be flying out together tomorrow at about midday. Um, so, just want to say my heart goes out to Hef as well. I'm sure most of you have heard the news that Hef injured his hand. I heard he fell down a set of stairs carrying some boxes and hurt his hand quite badly. Um, obviously, he would have been doing everything he could to still try and play, still try to go to Worlds, and he's obviously just unable to. So, I mean, that just must be devastating. My heart goes out to him. I, I can't imagine how I'd feel in his position. I mean, it would honestly, honestly, just be utterly depressing to be in that situation. Uh, he's a great guy, honestly. Like, um, nicest guy you'll ever meet in Halo. So, just yeah, I can't believe it's happened to him, and just horrible news for immunity as well. Um, in terms of their pickup with Junior, I think it's a good pickup and probably the best pickup they could have gotten. Um, he's still been grinding the game. He did grind the game harder than anybody. Um, haven't really had a chance to play their full team yet, or against our full team anyway. I think I played them with some randoms, and they're looking strong still. Obviously, I mean their immunity; they're looking strong, and I actually think they can they play a little better on some maps with Junior's aggression, um, but then on other maps his aggression does get them caught out. So I think if they can get that under wraps and get that under control, and Junior's smart enough to know what he can and can't do, and he's smart enough to work in with a team like that, I think they'll still do really, really well at Worlds and definitely make it out of that pool. Um, yeah, uh, EG and Renegades, both looking strong, especially Renegades. Um, not looking too much into it right now. We're mainly just focusing on our own game. Um, in particular, we're just lately we've been focusing on just staying alive a lot more. Um, just getting that extra three to five seconds of life while you're waiting for a teammate to get to you or even if you're just completely by yourself just that extra three to five seconds of life is helping us a lot because it's just wasting the other team's time and it just takes pressure off our team so it's something that we've been really working on and, and slowly paying off slowly working into our minds that don't challenge just stay alive when, when whenever your teammate makes that call um so when we have a last Laptop with us there. We are going to stream some of the scrims. We're not going to go definitely one series a day, I'd say, we'll be streaming for you guys. Uh, we may or may not put the communication in there, but I mean, obviously, we're trying to be pretty secretive with the US guys as well because they're going to be trying to study us just as hard as we're studying them. So we will be streaming, don't worry about that. Just not sure exactly how in depth we, we're going to go with it. Um, yeah, I mean, another point I wanted to point out is I am a firm believer of the law of attraction, which is basically where if you speak something and you really believe something and you work your ass off, it will happen. It's not going to happen without working your ass off, but if you really speak it and you really believe it, and you have to really believe it, it will happen. And I mean, you look at Junior, Junior spoke it and believed it. He was sure he was going to Worlds prior to Regionals. And fortunate for Hep, obviously, but I mean, Junior really did want it badly. And he's, the, the universe has served it to him, yes. Um, but I mean, I mean that, that was my whole philosophy going to Regionals and Worlds as well, is I'm going to speak it, I'm going to believe it. And it's going to happen. It's going to come true. And I know we're, we're doing the work for it. We're all working hard for it. So that's all we can do, really. All right, guys. Well, 
have a great couple of days. The next time I update you, will, I'll be in the US, so it'll probably be a full team update. But yeah, I mean, we'll be there in probably about 48 hours time, uh, maybe a little bit longer. So just yeah, stay tuned and we'll, we'll be keeping you updated. All right, thanks.